Okay, we have another section called Pro Tips. Pro Tips. And Pro Tips is, hey, you know, let's keep it uh, pickup and delivery specific, but what advice would you have somebody who was wanting to start a pickup and delivery service? So wanting to start a pickup and delivery service, um, hmm, advice to give them, if they want to start it the way that I did, not having their own, machines Mm -hmm. is to take the time to go in and network with the laundromat owners, take time to learn a little bit about the business. You know, like I was, you know, naive about it, but not a hundred percent because I did have a mentor, you know, someone that could kind of guide me if I was doing, you know, something right or wrong. Of course, we are going to make mistakes, but just to have that guidance helps. So, you, you know, go in and speak with them. And then that way also you don't, leave any sour tastes in their mouth, you know, like, like, hmm, who is this? You know, like, yeah, they're happy mm-hmm. you're bringing stuff in, but then also be courteous, you know, things like that. But pro tips, I would say, um, research, really research. I, you know, a lot of people look and they're like, like they look at the business and like, oh, well I can wash clothes. You know, it should be pretty easy, but it's not, it's a lot of work. The laundry's heavy. Um, you have to have storage space. You want to make sure um, I go and research the detergents that I'm using on the, um, oh, I forgot the name of it, but it's the EPA uh, site, but it's a site and they have all the different types of detergents there uh, mm-hmm. and their ratings. So, you know, A through F. And, and just to kind of, you know, but take that time, take that little bit of time to research what you want to do and try to find a niche. And if you can't, and then hone in on that. And then then you'll be okay. You know, Um, try to find something that sets you apart from everybody else. I like that. Yeah. I think that's really good um, advice, you know, especially at the end there when you, you know, find your niche, find something that sets you apart and go from there. Cause you can always scale bigger. Yes. Uh, But if you start too big, it's Mm -hmm. too broad. It's like that whole, if you're trying to, target everybody, you're targeting nobody. And so, you know, start, start in a niche. Like, I mean, Mm -hmm. I love what you're doing, you know, the eco-friendly customer and, you know, if you can expand it from there, you can expand it to, you know, different kinds of services or or however you want to, but starting in that niche and really nailing that allows you the opportunity to to grow from there. So I like Mm -hmm. that. Yes. 